Hey YouTube, this is Primetime Pokemon. I'm here with part two of me opening a base set two Pokemon booster box. If you missed out on part one, there should be a link to that video in the description of this video as well as a button on the screen that will lead you back to part one. This booster box opening is part of my 17 booster box opening series I'm doing for the summer of 2015. You'll find a link to that playlist in the description of this video. So, this base set 2 booster box I bought from Collector's Cash for $429.99. In the first half of this booster box I did pull out 6 holo cards. Nothing too great, any of the big 3, so I'm hoping to get some of the big 3 out of this half of the box. And at the end of this video I can summarize all 12 holo cards that I do indeed pull. Or at least I hope to get 12 total. Okay, so here are all the 18 packs I'll be opening. First pack starts off with Mewtwo on the cover artwork. Okay, so one, two, those two are both energy cards. We'll move to the front of the pack. And the first pack in the second half of this box starts off with a fighting type energy. There's a lightning type energy. Dugong. Pokemon Center. Growlithe. Drowsy, Magnemite, Bill, Bulbasaur, Jigglypuff, and the first rare is a Pidgeotto. So I believe that is the second Pidgeotto card I pulled out of this box. Okay, moving on to the second pack. I have actually opened a base set booster box on YouTube before I opened up that last summer. Definitely take a look at that if you haven't already. Okay, so this pack starts off with a fire type energy. There is a psychic type, Lickitung, Nidorina, Rhydon, Squirtle, Diglett, Pikachu, Charmander, Metapod, Ooh, there's a nice Holofoil card, a Wigglytuff. Unfortunately, this is the second Wigglytuff holo I've pulled, so that's reducing my chances of pulling either Charizard, Blastoise, or Venusaur. But it is nice to have straight out of packs base set two cards. Okay, Mewtwo pack now. Alrighty, so start off here with a Water type energy. There's a psychic type. Fero. Kakuna. War Turtle. Sandshrew. Poliwag. Vulpix. Bellsprout. Voltorb. And the rare in the pack, a Mr. Mime. So at least I have not gotten this card out of this box yet. Mr. Mime non hollow rare. Again, this set is a mixture of jungle and base set. My all-time favorite set would be Legendary Collection. That actually has a mixture of base set, jungle, fossil, team rocket. So, an even more of a mixture of cards. Okay, so, pack starts off here with a psychic type energy. There is a grass type energy. Seal. Professor Oak. Arcanine. Voltorb, Energy Removal, Pidgey, Potion Trainer, Cubone, and the rare in the pack is, oh, there's one of the big three I was hoping for, a Venusaur Holofoil. So that's a great pull right there. Very happy to get this card. Okay, so I'll set that aside. That is the second Holofoil card that I've pulled in this half of the box. Okay, next up here, Raichu on the pack. Okay, so it starts off with a lightning type energy. There's a fighting type energy. Kadabra, you don't see many Kadabra cards anymore. There's a Fero. Executor. Drowsy. Magnemite, Bill Trainer, Bulbasaur, 
Jigglypuff, and the rare in this pack, a Pokemon Breeder. So like I said in the first half of this box, I was well prepared to get several rare trainer cards out of this box. So it's not too disappointing to pull. Of course, I'd rather have a Pokemon, but that's okay. Still have several more packs to go and probably four more hollows to go to get either a Charizard, Blastoise, or both. Okay, so this pack starts off with a Psychic type energy. There's a Lightning type energy. Arcanine. Dratini. There's an Executor. Followed by Rattata. There is a Gust Wind Trainer, Diglett, there is a Tangela, Pikachu, and the rare card in this pack, Grass Type, Beedrill. So that's another card that I have not pulled so far out of this box. I actually have completed this set in my own collection. Probably opened up base set to the most of any of the original sets when I was younger. Okay, so I just moved the energy cards ahead of the rare card, but that's all right. So we have Rhydon, I like to mix it up, I guess. So we have a full heal trainer, Haunter, energy removal, Onyx, Nidoran, there's a Pidgey, the energy cards, which is a psychic type energy, lightning type energy, and let's see if I did the card trick right. Poliwag, and the final card here is a Pidgeot Hollow. So there's the third Hollow pull of this box, this half the box. Three more to go. Okay, speaking of Pidgeot, right on the cover artwork here. Okay, so we have a lightning type energy card. There's a water type energy card, followed by a Pokedex. There's a Magmar, haven't pulled too many of these, this box. Double colorless energy, now we're really mixing it up. Goldeen, Venonat, Bill Trainer, Bulbasaur, Cubone, and the rare in the pack. A Dragonair, so definitely a different pack than what I've opened so far. A lot of different cards. I like the look of this Dragonair quite a bit. Funny thing is, Dragonite's not even in the base set 2 at all. So, on to the next pack. There's a Raichu cover artwork. Okay, so... Pack starts off with here a psychic type energy card. There's a grass type energy card, a far fetched, parasect, polywhirl, ghastly, goldine, paris, onyx, and the rare in the pack, colorless type. Actually, after this rat attack is an electabuzz. Non hollow rare. I believe that is the second Electabuzz that I pulled out of this box. Okay, on to the next pack. Gyarados on the cover artwork. See a Butterfree right on the top of the pack. So move the two energy cards to the front. And Lightning type is the first card. Then there is a Water type. Then a Butterfree. After that, Machoke, Defender, Switch Trainer, Pokeball Trainer, Weedle, Sandshrew, Vulpix, and the rare in this pack. Oh, it could be a Charizard. Oh, a Ninetales Hollow. It was the right type, just not the right Pokemon. But a pretty good pull. Fourth Hollow pull of this box. This half of the box. 10th total. Okay, on to a Mewtwo pack. So move the energy cards to the front. And first card here, lightning type energy, grass type energy, 
Dugong, Farfetch'd, Ivysaur, Pokeball, Pikachu, Weedle, Doduo, Staryu, and be rare in this pack, a Pokemon Breeder Trainer card. So like I said, well prepared for all of the trainer cards that I pull out as rares. Still waiting on two more hollow cards. Nice blast of nostalgia for me to open up these older cards and a good start to my 17 booster box opening series. Okay, so this pack has a Psychic type Energy card, Fire type, Tauros, Weeping Bell, Charmeleon. How about a Char Charizard? There is a Staryu, Sandshrew, Poliwag. Vulpix, Bellsprout, and the rare, another trainer card, this one at least I have not pulled out of the box, a last trainer. Okay, on to the next pack. Okay, so, started off with a lightning type energy card. There's a Water Type, Super Potion, Ride On, Defender, Energy Removal, Pidgey, Potion, Cubone, Venonat, and the rare card in this pack is a Magneton Hollow. So there is the fifth Hollow card of this box, this half the box. Only one more total out of four packs. So getting down there, we'll not get both Blastoise and Charizard. Hoping for one of the two. That was incorrect. There's five more packs left. Four after this one. Okay, so started off here with a Psychic type energy. There's a Fire type energy. War Turtle. Kadabra. Dodrio, Gust of Wind, Ghastly, Goldeen, Paris, Onyx, and the rare is a Victory Bell. Okay, four packs left now. Okay, so start off with a Fighting type energy. There's a Psychic type, Weeping Bell, Energy Retrieval, Jinx. There's a Ghastly, Starmie, Execute, Needle Ran, Vulpix, and finally a Snorlax. That's a non-hollow. Wouldn't have minded a hollow foil of this card. Second Snorlax pull of this box. Okay, getting down there in packs now. Third to last pack. Okay, so this pack starts off with a grass type energy card. There's a lightning type energy. Poliwhirl. Double colorless, I have not pulled too many of these out of this box. Marowak, Spiro, Ghastly, Voltorb, Paris, Bellsprout, and the rare grass type is a Nido King Hollow. So that's all 12 that'll get out of the box, but a pretty decent one to finish off the hollow pulls. Again, I can summarize the exact cards that I pulled out of this box at the end of this video after these last two packs. I apologize, I probably should have went through the hollow cards out of part one. Okay, so this one starts off with a lightning type energy, fire type, maintenance trainer, charmeleon, lickitung, Ratata, Paris, Rhyhorn, Meowth, Gust of Wind, and finally, 
an Electrode. So a nice non-hollow rare that I have not pulled so far. This one's a very colorful card. It's actually two Electrode cards. One's from Jungle and that one's from Base Set. Okay, last pack here out of this base set two booster box, the first booster box that I'll be opening up out of the 17 that I purchased for this summer. So last pack here starts off with a grass type energy. There's a psychic type energy, dugong, energy retrieval, haunter, jigglypuff, goldine, bulbazor, weedle, Ratata, and the final card in this box is a Kangaskhan non hollow rare. But overall, pretty much as expected, pull wise, pulled out 12 hollow foil cards total. When I consider the ones that I actually pulled out, pretty disappointing overall. I didn't get really any of the ones that I was really, really hoping for, other than Venusaur. And possibly Alakazam, I didn't get any of the Eevee Evolutions as Holofoils or Snorlax. I was really hoping for Charizard or Blastoise, but with 130 cards in the set, it's definitely hard to get all the ones that you're really hoping for. So here are the Holos from this half of the box, second half. Six total. First one, Nine Tails. Next we have Pidgeot. There's Wigglytuff. Venusaur, probably the favorite one that I pull out of all 12 total. There is a Magneton. And finally, a Needle King. So that's the second half of the box. And then the first half of the box, these are the six that I pulled. Now, I'll try to do a little bit better, like I said, in future box openings to state the pulls at the end of the first part and second part. So here's a Raichu, Poliwrath. There is an Alakazam, probably my second favorite Holofoil pull. There is a Wigglytuff, two Wigglytuff in this box. There is a Scyther and a Zapdos. So there's all 12 Hollows that I pulled out of the box. So as expected pulls overall, average pulls. So there you have it. There's the completion of the base set two booster box being opened. Thanks everyone for watching. Like I said, this one is part of my 17 booster box opening. I'll have 16 more booster boxes to open up in this series. Next week I'll go to newest and then after that I'll be oldest newest. So it'll be Roaring Skies next week and then after that it'll be Expedition. So thanks everyone for watching. Make sure before you go to check out all the links in the description of this video and stay tuned for more videos. Thank you.